what you see here is the uh, preliminary prototype of a project that's going to be deployed at the Carnegie Museum of Art at the top of 2020 in their new permanent Teeny Harris archive room. What we see here is uh, a prototype of a system that we've developed between the Studio for Creative Inquiry and the Carnegie Museum of Art, uh, the Teeny Harris Archive, uh, to organize the collection of Charles Teeny Harris. Teeny Harris was an African-American photojournalist active from approximately 1935 to 1975. And during his lifetime, he took close to 80,000 photographs. Unfortunately, after his death, his negatives and photographs were badly shuffled. And it's believed also that Teeny Harris was functionally illiterate because his photographs had almost no written information explaining who was in them, where they were taken, even things like dates and locations were absent. So uh, for the last 15 years, the Teeny Harris Archive at the Carnegie Museum has been very active in uh, trying to figure out who's in the photographs and how they, you know, what, what they depict. <clears throat> um, this is an incredibly important archive of black culture in the 20th century uh, during the Jim Crow eras and the Civil Rights eras. Um, and uh, we decided to, to, to collaborate with the, uh, the Carnegie Museum to see if we could use machine learning and computer vision techniques in combination with their human annotation techniques uh, to see if we could uh, help bring more information to the archive where it was missing. So in this prototype, um, these machine learning and, and computer vision techniques are used to group images that are similar, allowing for comparisons that have never really been, for, been before possible. For example, in this section over here, we can see here are pictures of weddings. And so we can pick a given happy couple and sort of see what that you know, wedding would have looked like. Um, in other parts of this map of, of approximately 60,000 images shown here, um, there are, for example, people photographed in Teeny Harris's studio in front of a, a circular background that he used for many of his portraits. So we hope that this tool will help people understand the landscape of images that Charles Teeny Harris took. Um, he was a photojournalist for the Pittsburgh Courier, sort of the paper of record for black culture in the 20th century. And we think this is an incredibly important and very interesting archive that the public will really enjoy. Um, this exhibit, like I mentioned, will be uh, at the Teeny in the Teeny Harris room of the Carnegie Museum of Art starting in January 2020.